stars dappled the sky like grains of sand and black velvet, and with the help of the moon, cast dancing shadows across the dense, unforgiving forest. With the dark depth of the forgiving forest. Barely visible, a fortress of a library lurked in the dark of the bushes and tall pine trees. Sneaky cats slunk in and out of the invisible passage built into the side of the library. A small girl sat silently in the library reading a thick volume about a book, thick volume book about cats. Her name was Cloudy and she was sure that cats didn't talk. Cloudy had snuck through the cat passage when she thought she heard voices. She had been forbidden by her auntie not to go in there because her auntie definitely didn't definitely didn't want her precious books getting grubby fingerprints on them. Now as Cloudy sat in the deafening silence of the library, she was sure about two things. One, these books must be decades old because every time she turned a page a small tsunami of dust appeared and two, she must be dreaming. 